Let's say you're wanting to do some single arm movements for symmetry and also for core strength that generally you'd be doing with dumbbells. And as we know, dumbbells, you're going to need a spotter, and at times it can get a little awkward. The XBT is going to make it to where you can do dumbbell type lifts, but with the safety of the spot free braking mechanism. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So, what you're going to do is you're going to first load one side of the XBT, put a collar on there, doesn't matter which side. And then for bench, what you're going to do is, first you've got to acknowledge that you've got weight on one side, so you've got to balance this bar, but you want the weight to come down to about three to four inches from your chest. Then you let it go, and you're going to widen out the grip just a little bit. Then you're just going to release the one side. Now you've got a core strength, or a core engage on the left side here, since I'm working the right side. And away you go. Now you can do your one arm bench, and if you get stuck, use the brakes. And to switch sides, there's no need to go and load the weight on the other side. All you're going to do is you're going to flip 360, position yourself under the bar. Now you're able to work the left side. In addition to doing bench, you can also do curls. And with this, all you're going to do is you're going to grab it on one side, release it, and away you go. You can also do shoulder press with the single arm movement by raising the bar. I'd just say about a couple inches above your head. Again, loading up one side, put the collar on, widen out the grip. You don't have to go all the way out. You'll get some imp imp impairment on the movement. You're going to grip it. I'm going to go behind the head. You can do your one arm shoulder press. Switch sides, same thing, very simple, turn around. 